Restaurants, one of the hardest hit industries in the pandemic, there's now a move to make alcohol to go here to stay. The New York Restaurant Association pushing for it to become law. In a survey, they found 78% of New Yorkers favor permanently allowing booze to go. The executive order currently expires on June 5th. This was a lifeline for crippled New York restaurants. And this comes as other restrictions have eased. Friday night saw the end of a curfew for outside dining. Well, I think besides the curfew change, it's mostly about the weather. So now that the weather has been nice, everything is picking up just organically. Everybody's feeling good. The city planning department is drafting permanent outdoor dining regulations right now. Lawmakers would need to sign off on the takeaway alcohol measure. Also on the table, making sidewalk dining expansions permanent. The city planning department taking that up next month. Instacart, the food delivery service, also just got the green light to deliver alcohol from 7-Eleven in New York as well. So the state should really be arming our restaurants with all of the tools that they need in order to be able to make ends meet and keep all of uh, the workers and their families afloat as well. New York was the first state to do this to go alcohol. A lot of states followed suit. 20 of them now have laws on the books allowing this. Another 15 states are exploring it. It is the most seismic shift we have seen around alcohol sales and consumption since the prohibition was lifted back in 1933. Incredible changes.